Alright, everyone, it is me yet again, Judson Chen. Oh, boy. Oh, I'm glad that I adjust the camera a little bit. I also have to go to Target again, just buy some more ice cream. You know, because I always have ice cream during the summertime. It's cheaper to actually go to the store and buy it. So anyway, as I've been saying, crypto's been very slow, so not a lot of content to cover. All right, and then I even checked today, and really, there's only two projects, right? Everyone else is just recycling old content, which, I mean, I guess that's, like, okay, all right? You know, because obviously you do whatever you want, but I, you know, you know me. I prefer to cover something new and fresh, and something that's, like, different, all right? You know, because, you know, you don't really need me to repeat stuff, right? Unless we're, you know, going over, you know, stock markets and stuff. Uh so this is interesting. So we went straight up and now we're going straight down. Yeah, this is just great. Uh, let's see. Well, but, I mean, really, the market should be going up. You know, even the dollar index is down. Bond yields are up. So there's really just no excuse for what's, like, going on. You know, in fact, everything seems to be down. I mean, crypto's down a little bit. And, of course, you know, Sphere's doing pretty well. Right? It doesn't take a genius to figure out, hey, demand goes up. Or uh, stays the same, but supply constantly goes down. What happens to the price of the uh, commodity, right? Yeah. <laughs> All right. So anyway, uh, so Murdoch DeFi didn't really have anything good. Uh, in fact, I'm actually seeing that his subscribe count is actually going down, All right, which doesn't surprise me because we keep pushing scam project after scam project, along with toxic communities like the Paramount Staker scammers and those pieces of, uh, you know, trash. Yeah, I mean, you know, actual people like you and me, you know, we start getting annoyed. So, yeah. But luckily, you know, Yana Crypto still is, you know, still vet, uh, vets his projects. So I think he definitely covered this one. Uh, so first off, let's see, did they mention this up front? Okay, so they have two partnerships, which, all right, I guess we'll find out what that really means. But they said, they, uh, well, according to Yana Crypto, Quantic Cube? That's spelled with a Q. Oh, that's actually pretty nice. Um, let me just hide my camera for the Connect Wallet thing, just in case you want to look at that. Okay. Oh, that allowed me my dummy MetaMask. So they're partnered with Alto Protocol and Titan. You know, not you know. And funny enough, I never actually did a video on Titan, but that's just because I kind of was assuming it'll <laughs> go down like everything else. So I just couldn't really be bothered with it. All right. I don't know, maybe, maybe if enough people nag me about it, I'll do it. And uh, first things first, uh, I did not actually realize this was a crops farmer fork. So right off the bat, this actually is uh, already doing really well. And they seem to have some sort of automation, so... Alright, that's really good. Alright, we're going to make this bigger first. Alright, so first things first, there's already $366,000 total locked in BUSD, so that's really effing good. Well, right off the bat, this is really healthy. All right, so this is a crops farmer fork. All right, so you have 8% daily, 8% uh, referral. There's an 8% tax, which I assume is on everything. Beautiful, 24-hour reward cutoff. 12 hours, you have to wait on compounding. So this is, <coughs> so this right here is already doing what I always recommend, which is BNB Miner, right? Because they cut off your rewards at 24 hours. There's an 8% tax for early withdrawal, so that's good. Uh, benefit for Quantico up to 1.7% stacking compound bonus uh, every 12 hours. Okay. And the max bonus goes to 20.4%. Based on the number of Quantic tokens whole, uh, held. So where do you buy Quantic? Right? Wait, let me read that again. Oh, this is only for the referral. Yeah, we don't care about the referral, then. 3% of, of this tax, I assume, out of this 8% tax, will be used to buy back the Quantic token. So that's actually pretty good. Extra stack compounding bonus for all. By the way, like I said, Crops Farmer is going to be like the next minor thing going forward because they actually work so far, or at least it's sustainable. Uh, you know, you're going to see a lot more people, you know, using minor projects to sustain, like, you know, their original projects, right? You know, more, more, more likely, you know, Titano style projects. So that's good. That's very, very good. Right. Cause for me, I mean, 
again, Titano style projects are just out of style. I mean, Titano still hasn't recovered, all right? Seifu is already down to like, what, $13, $12 or whatever. You know, it's not looking too good. It's not looking too good. In fact, I actually had to sell off a lot of my Orca protocol and, um, yeah, my Orca protocol and my Web3, right, to go buy, like, you know, minor projects. I think I actually put it into Royal Pay and, uh, whatchamacallit, uh, more BUSD Crops Yield Farmer, right? Not to be confused with the minor version of BUSD Crops Farmer. So, I mean, I still have my tokens in that, but, you know, it's still, it's still under a lot of pressure. But with that being said, you know, people are figuring it out, because I think the ideal would be a well-made crops farmer fork, something like this, right, like Quantic, plus, you know, Royal Pay style Titano uh, projects. And then you're, go you're, you're golden, right, you're golden. Or, or at least you should be more sustainable because I think Royal Pay is starting to have a hard time going up, which makes sense because, you know, it's just gone straight up. So we'll see how they handle their correction. Okay. Um, extra stacking compound bonuses for all holders of a partnership token. Extra referral bonuses for all holders of a partnership token. Extra stacking. Okay, so you can get more... Oh, wait, yeah. Oh, I did not read this wrong. Yeah, so you get a stacking bonus based on the number of Quantic tokens you hold, which doesn't tell you what that is. Or maybe it tells you down here. Your partnership token can also use referral bonuses to buy back market their token. 100% of initial initial partnership agreement costs will go into contract and will remain untouchable. So this is a little complicated. All I know is they know what they're doing. <laughs> That's all I can tell you. They know what they're doing. All right, so this is actually pretty smart. And it does help everyone because it basically means everyone has to buy the underlying token. So basically, they're trying to create some kind of, you know, lightweight utility. That's really what it comes down to. An investor can automate at any time. The investor can choose a compound every 4 to 24 hours. We suggest choosing 12 to 24 to receive the stacking quantic partnership bonuses right so you would obviously do 12 hours then all right without a doubt you gotta do 12 hours and then of course you have to hold titan tokens and quantic tokens and uh alto tokens so that's three tokens you would have to hold uh the automation will follow the 6-1 strategy okay it's all automatic and the automation fee is and then they also will take a one percent uh, tax on every auto compound and auto claim, which I think is fine. So this is actually a pretty good project, believe it or not. I mean, I'm already kind of strapped, but if I had a little extra money, yeah, I would definitely do this project. Yeah, without a question, without a doubt. I mean, it, ha it would be a little more complicated, right? But I mean, this is obviously quite worth it. I mean, until I'm still not too thrilled that it's eight percent daily. That's a lot, but at least there's an eight percent tax. But again, the problem is this tax doesn't really apply to compounding. So sustainability could still be an issue. Um, but, you know, on the other hand, you also don't get the compounding bonus unless you buy tokens. So uh, so, if you, so if you choose not to buy the tokens, then the dilute your reward dilution will go down. Or wait, no, your reward dilution goes up. Because other people are not only compounding, obviously, especially because everyone's going to be using this auto compounder. So you're constantly getting diluted. But they're likely going to have, you know, one, if not all three stacking compounding bonus tokens, Quantic, Alto, and Titan. So that means you're going to get, you're going to get uh, diluted even faster. All right. So, yeah. Um, okay. Cubix. Well, this one says Quantic. So I assume this is not a typo. Uh, okay, well, I guess you would have to go to their Telegram or Discord or something. Wait, they, they have a Discord and Telegram. They don't have a Twitter, which is kind of funny, actually. All right, well, I haven't seen that before. All right, so basically you have to just buy a bunch of whatever, and then you'll just get, you know, your stacking bonus, hopefully. Uh, but... Let's see. Yeah, this autom this automatic. I just realized they said there's a twelve hour timer. 
time until next compound bonus is activated. 12, oh, okay, and you have to compound 12 times anyway. So you're forced to compound for six days anyway. Okay, so they made, so they actually changed their contract a little bit too. So you don't actually have to wait 12 hours to compound, but what happens is you just don't get the bonus if you compound faster than 12 hours. So you're essentially compounding every 12 hours, or for some strange reason, you might pick 24, but that actually means you lose money, right? Because you're not earn you're not earning any more money between hour 12 and hour 24 and you're getting diluted constantly then you compound well you just you, you you're fall, you're falling behind you want to compound as early as possible right you know because that's the power of compound interest right the more you compound and the sooner you do it the more money you make so anyway this is a very good project this is actually probably the best iteration of crops farmer forks i I would add to this to the playlist, believe it or not. The problem is I'm not going to put any money into this, so you know I kind of don't want to lie. But this is a very good project. Like this, this would definitely go into you know the playlist, all right. Um, and on top of that, I mean it's got a very healthy uh, you know uh, BUSD lock. Um, yeah. Oh, and on top of that, you do have to buy those three tokens, right? I don't know too much about it except maybe Alto, right? Because obviously I covered that like I guess a month ago now. Man, time really flies. So, yeah. But that being said, we went over a lot in this project, but that's because there's actually a lot to go over. But yeah, this looks this this looks good. This looks good. So, and obviously, set your automation to 12 hours, and then just go buy, you know, Quantic, uh, Alto, or Titan tokens, or I guess all three, I guess, just so you can get the stacking compound bonus. Now the problem is, I still don't know how much you need to get the full 1.7%. I assume this, because again, the max bonus is 20.4%. So if they require you to buy like $10,000 of, of each coin, I mean, well, okay. Well, in that case, that might, that could cause a problem, right? That could cause a problem, but you'll just have to go into their Discord, because normally I would assume you have to look, they would have a, tw a Twitter, and then they would just tell you, but I don't know. Or I guess it changes all the time, right? So... Yeah, which would actually annoy me personally because I don't want to have to like join endless discords and Twitters and whatever and then check everything. It's just annoying. You know, I want to keep my things simple. Yeah. So, anyway, <clears throat> uh, like, subscribe, share this video around. Thank you again to all the old and new people watching this video. I rely on you to grow this channel, and we've been doing pretty well. I mean, I think we're at 1,600 or a little bit more while everyone else is actually going down and again that's because you know i tell it like it is and i don't get paid to do this right i just give you this straight up thing at first i was getting like a little uncomfortable about it because i see everyone else getting paid and pushing scam projects and they're still growing but now that i see them declining you know and then i'm on the rise then i understand now oh, okay so yeah telling uh, being honest actually works you know which is kind of shocking these days right so uh but yeah well, that being said, I mean, I can't say enough good things about this project. Um, I don't know, maybe I should actually add this to the playlist and then just write a note saying, I don't currently have money in this, but I would. Uh, I don't know. What do I do? Um, what do I do? What do I do? You know what? I'll leave it off the playlist for now because we want to keep my channel, you know, as honest as possible. But, I mean, if you want, like, this is just, this is a really good project. I, I would put my money in this. But right now, you know, I'm... I need to simplify. I got too many, you know, projects open. Obviously, um, I have to admit, though, I really do like this uh, automation. Uh, but with that being said, you know, maybe I'll actually come back to it later, right? I'll put like a little bit of money because I'm right now. I'm saving. I'm spending the rest of this month saving up money to withdraw it so I can, you know, refill my bank account. So, you know, because it's gonna be a while before. You know, Sphere hits like 10 cents or 25 cents or whatever, and then I could start putting a little bit of money into like other projects. But yeah, I really like this. I really like this. They, they, the, only, the only thing bad thing I have to say about Quantic is, you know, where is their Twitter? But I mean, eh, whatever. I mean, if Yada Crypto says they're legit and they have a partnership with, you know, Alto and Titan, who are obviously also legit and are not rug pulling, last I heard, right? Because I haven't heard anything bad and. No news is good news. Yeah, I mean, yeah, I wouldn't have a problem putting my money into this. You know, how much would I put in? 
Yeah, I would probably put like a moderate bag, you know. If I had a lot of money, yeah, I wouldn't mind putting in a moderate large bag, but nothing more than that. All right, because remember, you got to keep in mind, you know, this is uh, 366,000, so I don't know the context behind that number. Is it on the way down, is it on the way up, or is it kind of, like, you know, stable? So, all right, I've rambled on long enough. I'll see you in the next video. It's going to be about Libra's minor, right, which also looks even more complicated. So that could be a long video as I try to do the research live. So, all right, we covered a lot. Let's keep it under, yeah, 15 and a half minutes. That's not too bad. So I'll see you next video. Thanks again for watching. And, of course, you know, spread the video around, spread the channel around, and definitely check out Quantic Cube with a Q up here, not a C, with a, which is how you spell cube. And yeah, this looks really, really good. This looks very, very good. I wonder if they're going to bring in a third partnership. But then I guess that maybe starts diluting things. I don't know. I'm sure these Quantic people will <laughs> figure it out. All right.